can't figure this out. Is love for Christians only? That's conditional. Thinking of yourself as holy. Why you? Hey guys, so um, welcome back to yet another vlog. I just arrived at the hotel uh, a couple of minutes ago, maybe an hour ago actually, not, not minutes. Um, <laughs> I've taken a shower, taken off my makeup, and now I want to go out to the mall. So um, I'm in uh, Florida and uh, I'm, I just need to take my phone to be fixed to the Apple store. That's where I'm going because I dropped my phone and I cracked my screen. And so now I need to go find out how much it's gonna be to fix it, how much it's gonna cost me to fix it so I can, um, yeah, get it back to, to normal. And uh, yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do now. And I guess we'll catch up at the Apple store. If there's anything interesting to show you, I will show you as we go. my first time what would you recommend I do uh, you want to visit first and foremost uh, little Hill by the sea okay and what is it what is it exactly it's it's a it's a place uh, it's a, a good hangout where okay. a lot of people uh, socialize and uh, mm -hmm. they have a lot of store okay. where uh, most of the store they have TV and you watch the game and you could uh, Drink whatever you like. Mm -hmm. You could eat also. It's also by by the beach. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, nice. And is the weather now like good at this time? Cause we thought it was gonna be like 23 degrees, um, but when we landed, it was like 18 degrees. Is it? Is this like a good time? Mm -hmm. 18 degrees. What? Far, 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 uh, Celsius. 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 Sorry. <laughs> Oh, that would be crazy. <laughs> uh, Celsius, so that, what's that, um, 65? Somewhere like that. Yeah. Somewhere there about. 65, yeah. 69 degrees. So, um, is this like a good time? Is this like a good time to come to uh, Florida? Florida? Like, yeah. The weather's good. It is a good time. The weather is kind of cool. If you like cool weather, it's not that humid. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. uh, oh, usually it's very humid. Yeah, usually okay. it's very humid. Okay. Okay.
Macy's and um, I was just looking to see if I can get tights. I don't know if you guys can actually hear me. I was looking to see if I can get nice tights that will last me long because I feel like I buy a lot of tights and most of them Sorry, can you guys see me? I feel like I buy a lot of types, tights, <laughs> and most of them don't even last that long. So, yeah, I end up, you know, having to buy something else because it's faded or something. So, I'm gonna try and see if I can find something that maybe will last. I don't know. Yeah. to buy clothes or anything I really most times I don't find what I need most times I don't find what I'm looking for it's oh, okay I think today is one of those days again because I really don't see like I see a lot of things but they're not it's not what I'm looking for you know it's not what I need so I just see stuff but Stuff that doesn't work. That's what I find by myself always. Um, one time I bought this, uh, I bought tights from Nike. No, are they tights? Like just pants, just nice regular pants from Nike. And they faded, you know, and I was, I was very disappointed because I was thinking like, uh, you know, tights for Nike should be nice, right? So, but it isn't a fit. You know, like, surely it should last a long time because they're expensive and they're nice. Shock on me. So now, I don't just go around buying anything. I'm very careful. And I make sure to check. Uh, I make sure to, to check and see that it's something that can actually last. I'm not just buying the name because I think then I was thinking, oh, because it's Nike, it definitely has to be to be good but it, it turned out to be a mess at a sequi va for one year i think i think i had it for only like six months and a few was shopping and you know because i liked it i would wear it every day and that was well not every day but that that kind of was a problem is that i i would wear it a lot <laughs> so maybe it wasn't necessarily their fault but it's no it still was because it was really expensive and i'm just wondering why it faded you know basically that's that's all i was wondering so anyway i think i'll now leave macy's because i honestly don't see anything i'm gonna go to sephora and then maybe just grab something to eat because at this point i'm i'm really hungry my lips are embarrassingly dry <sighs> yeah so sephora
so this is just like a, a sunscreen in a stick so you just go like this and it's SPF 50 so nice and quick and it's not shiny because I realized that today when I put on sunscreen it was super shiny yeah so you know I'm trying to get something that's less, less shiny for the days so you don't want to wear makeup on top of it and then um, I'm just wanting to buy stuff from this brand because this lady that does my hair in Kenya told me let me, see, let me just turn on the light so you guys can see uh, the flash okay maybe sorry I can't do it now but the lady who does my hair in Kenya told me that this is actually good so I just got a few things let me show you guys quickly so I just got a few a few things from um, the brand just a shampoo, a conditioner, and a treatment to go, you know, just to to do my hair when I'm not able to actually go to the hair salon. So if I'm in the hotel, I can actually do it myself. I hope you guys can see me because the lighting is not the best in like in the store, especially where I'm standing. So I hope you guys can actually see what I'm doing. I also saw this online, and this is like a SPF spray but um focus 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 okay all right here we go it's an SPF spray why is the focus there <laughs> but yeah I don't I don't think I want to try this because I'm already getting the stick so I'll just pass on this one yeah, but it looks like it's, it's quite good. It looks like it's good, and it's SPF 40, but we'll pass today for that. Okay. Okay, so Sephora is done. show you the yeah. stuff that they have yeah, so awesome. they're really great they yeah. allowed me to actually go yeah. all right <laughs> enjoy Thank you guys. Bye. Bye.
I woke up and I just want to dash out quickly and then come back uh, quickly to the next hotel because uh, I sent my packages to the next hotel instead of this one. <laughs> so now I need to go pick them up and then, um, yeah, and then when I come back, I need to go out again. So I just need to dash quickly and grab the things that I need from out there. Sorry, I left you guys hanging yesterday. I was so tired, as you can imagine. I mean, I had just landed and went straight out, so I was exhausted. But I'm really glad because I managed to do everything that I needed to do. And I feel like today I don't have as much stress and I'm much more relaxed and I'm much more, I'm, I'm fresh, I actually feel fresh. It's noon, so I woke up around 11 or 10.30, so I just feel really relaxed. And yeah, I'm grateful, I like myself like this, you know? I prefer myself relaxed as opposed to stressed out and tired. So yeah, let me rush to the hotel and then we'll go to the mall again to them all always well actually i know that i had mentioned to you guys that um we will go that we might go to miami today what happened is no one really came up with a plan yeah i have been I've, I've been to miami before the last time i was here we drove out there and it was nice and you know whatever but i just i don't want to do it again <laughs> because i feel like there's nothing really like what am i going to actually do you know everyone else is going to we wait wait hold on we actually thought of going to south beach but it's basically like i said it's just like clubbing and and a beach <laughs> which would have been fun but i just feel like i'll be left doing nothing so with that um i'm just i'm just like maybe Maybe just do my other errands and not, you know, go to Miami. I hope you guys can see me. I feel like my my camera is very low. Wait, let me. Is that is that better? Mm, I hope so. Um, what was I saying? I'm grateful for this day. I just woke up feeling really grateful um, for my marriage, for. <clears throat> for just the life that God has given me right now. And by right now, I mean just being alive and being happy, like I said, in my marriage and um, being, feeling centered, feeling centered and not feeling like, um, like, I mean, I know everything around me is not the best. And by around me, I mean in my own life. <laughs> a lot of the things that are happening in my life, I'm believing God for a change and just things to get, you know, just better in different ways. But I just feel uh, right now that my, my feet are on the ground. I don't feel like I am, you know, there was a point that I felt that my that I could not wake up like my mornings were just depressed and I just felt like and I'm not using that word loosely and I don't mean like clinical depression but I, I just felt like when I woke up I was just like uh I just don't want to wake up I don't want to do this and maybe it has to do with the sun outside and how bright it looks that has made me feel like yeah it's a good day I'm calm but um yeah, I'm, I'm sure you guys have seen some days on my vlog when I just, I, I look and feel like tired and just hopeless and that I don't want to do anything. So I'm grateful that those days are much less now in my life than, than you know, than more. So I just want to be grateful for that, even if it's a small thing, just that today I didn't wake up feeling like my world is crashing i'm grateful for that for for today you know and then we just take a step a day at a time and move a day at a time um that's what i'm doing even with like just my my creativity my youtube my my instagram if i wake up and i feel like i can create and i can do this i do it 
if if I feel like um, I just don't want to do that today and I'm not able to do that today, then I just, I take a break, you know, and I just pace myself and tell myself, you know what, it's okay. You don't have to do it today. You really don't have to kill yourself trying to do it. Just take a moment and you'll do it when you have the energy to do it and when you feel like you actually can. So yeah, that's what I'm, I'm grateful for today. Yeah, thank you, Jesus. Okie dokes, let me go. I haven't even had breakfast and it's lunchtime. I mean, what else is new on this channel? She, she just, no. Bye. All right, so I came back from the other uh, hotel, picked up my packages, as you can see, and I thought it would be fun to do a little unboxing, okay, situation. So that's what we're gonna do. I don't think I've ever done an unboxing on my channel. So this is my first time. So this is a package from Sigma. I hope the sound is not too loud. With all the boxes and stuff. I've been wanting to buy Sigma boxes for the longest time. The longest, the longest time you guys. They're very expensive. Well, that's very subjective. <laughs> but in my opinion, I feel like they're expensive, right? Like they're a good, a pretty penny. So yeah, they're quite expensive. And I got this um, ultimate blending brush set because I mostly wanted eye brushes. So yeah, this is what I got. Um, I think it was, I actually don't even know how much it was. Let me see if they have, let me put this down. Let me see if they have one of those shipping. No, they don't. I wanted to see if they have one of those shipping uh, documents that actually, you know, the ones that tell you how much it was. And da, 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 da. So anyway, they don't. The package comes as is. And this is their most wanted brush set. Five favorite face and eye brushes. Oh, and they look good. I really needed this because I had one from Morphe. And it just got really scratchy. It, just, it was very, very scratchy, so... This is their famous F80 uh, Kabuki brush. I don't think I need to open all the way because at least, ooh, I already broke it. So at least you can see everything from like the outside, but yeah, that's all. This is my package from Amazon. Um, and this is uh, basically a viewfinder. I bought this for when I'm doing like my tutorials because I didn't have a viewfinder, so most of the time I was just guessing. I'm not really, uh, I couldn't really see what I was doing, so yeah, I finally got this. I hope it's nice. I really hope it's nice. It's from uh, Best View. I watched reviews, so before I bought this, so I really hope that it's actually nice. And then the last package is for Morphe. Here is the palette in all its Jaclyn Hill glory. <laughs> it comes in a glossy uh, box, white, just like the original palette. And there she is. Oh, and I like this silver accent border going on. It's just here, but it's really cute. And there she is. There she is. I just cannot stop looking at, at the palettes. I love this. So nothing else in there. Really great. Okay, sorry. So sorry. Very sorry. Okay, so Sephora. So these are samples of a cleanser that I got. This is the birthday gift that they give you if you're a VIB, an insider. This is the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Pencil that I got. It's basically just black eyeliner, which I needed. And uh, this is waterproof. Is it waterproof? Wait, before I say that. This is a... Yes, it is. Long-lasting, 24-7. So I like that it's 24-7 because we all know that I wear my makeup for much longer than that. This is uh, the Dr. Jot makeup, makeup mask, sheet masks. These are the masks that I, I'm always talking about. I love to wear these when you have 
like a long flight or like a big event when you need your face to look snatched because somehow it just really plumps up your face and just i don't know it just does something i mean of course the masks masks the max the masks are different they do different things there's a hydro mask there's a brightening mask there's a clearing mask they have different things pore correcting la 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 peeling but i just feel like all of them leave you so hydrated and your skin just looks nice and tight and it just it just looks beautiful and it's so easy to apply makeup when you after, before i mean after you do this so if you are a makeup artist and maybe you have a bride and she has a long obviously she has a long day it's her wedding day this would be really good to do before you go on with makeup i mean you can put in an extra charge obviously on the like on the package but it's it really does wonders for your skin and it really just makes the skin look nice and just accept everything that you put on it absorbs everything that you put on it so yeah and this is a concealer that i bought from sephora it's just their usual um bright future concealer i just use this i'm gonna use this to contour because for the longest time i've not had a concealer to contour so i picked this up and this is my usual trusty red lipstick lady balls from Too Faced this is their melted matte gorgeous shade gorgeous application consistency formula this is creamy and nice amazing uh, I finally got myself a NARS highlighter I'm excited about this um, this is in the shade scent Bots. scent Bots. that's the shade okay it's gorgeous 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 I don't think you can see what I'm doing but I don't want to touch it too much I don't want to touch it too much oh, it's so nice oh, so I've been recently buying hair products from this company Moroccan oil um, this is the extra volume shampoo someone told me uh, this lady who does my hair her name is Alice hi Alice if you're watching this video in Kenya in Nairobi so um, she told me that this this line is actually really nice and this brand so i just recently picked up their stuff i've been using their conditioner and shampoo i've been using their repair this is for volume i've been using their repair the repair version of this and i've liked it so far so i decided let me pick up something else and uh, this is a treatment hydration hydrating mask for hydration it's basically a deep conditioner and yeah treatment so that's that and then this is their restorative hair mask for weakened and damaged hair and that's it I think that's it that's all that's all that I've got so now I'm gonna head out like I said I have a few things that I want to do I'm really not sure that this is gonna be one vlog because I feel like I have a lot of footage and I feel like there's a lot going on so I hope you watch it all the way to the end you know sometimes people ask me for like vlogs like oh give us more travel vlogs give us more shopping vlogs so that's what i'm trying to do but then I'm, i get scared of giving you like 35 minute vlogs because i don't know if you, you're gonna sit down for that long and watch it and i don't know if you're gonna enjoy it so if this vlog is half an hour i hope that you sit through it and i hope that you watch all of it because uh it's fun i'm fun i'm trying to be fun I'm trying to be fun. I promise you, I'm trying. Just watch the vlog. <laughs> Bye. Oh, that smells good. Why is this half? Sephora. Another quick thing that I wanted to say before, you know, moving on to the next slide is thank you guys for the subscriptions. The channel has been growing. I'm happy. I'm really happy. Everything is going really well and I'm grateful and I can't wait to see what the rest of the year has to hold. It's just February. It's February, right? Today is October. What day is it today? Yes. Oh, I have a watch that has days. 28th. So, happy days. Hmm? Good morning, guys. Good morning, good morning. I know my lips are super dry. Uh, I just woke up, took a shower. 
I'm sorry. I was supposed to film yesterday, but you know, things don't always go the way you want. Mm. I basically just got really tired at the mall and I was just not able to do it. I was just feeling exhausted. So I'm sorry, I apologize, but yeah, I didn't film. Uh, right now I'm just trying to start getting ready for the flight and all right, so I'm now done with my makeup and I'm headed out. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, I'm sorry I couldn't show you guys as I did my makeup because obviously it would have taken me much longer to do it and to finish. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and I'll see you guys on my next video. I'm still trying to finish off with my mascara.